This is not what you expect to see. Drivers doing burnouts in the middle of a busy intersection and no police in sight here, but police are very much aware and working to track down the people involved. Wake News reporter Jolina Esperito live in Northport tonight. Jolina, have police made any arrests? So far, police arrested one person. They say he's part of a group who met up here at this intersection to zoom around and do donuts. Now, if you take a look, you can still see the skid marks even in the dark from the tires. They stretch through the entire intersection. And I spoke with one witness who got caught up in it, and he wasn't too happy about that. Tires cost money, man. Y'all tripping. Hey man, can I go home? This is what Felix Jordan got caught up in after a long, hard week's work doing home renovations early Saturday morning. It's 1.35 in the morning on Friday night. I'm trying to go home, please. Coming through here, not expecting that, looking for cop presence to be here was unexpected, exciting, and scary at the same time. Scary to see young people on the road blocking traffic speeding in circles with some of the group repeatedly almost getting hit by cars as tires screech. I'm just talking about uh, certainly when you start seeing people with ski masks and guns in their hands and you know that sort of thing I mean that's just not something that's going to be tolerated here and uh, we'll do everything in our power to keep it from happening again. Northport Police Public Information Officer Josh Taylor told me the group came from Tampa and Fort Myers and decided to meet at Toledo Blade and Price Boulevards to take over the intersection. One arrest was made, 19-year-old David Oliveira. For me, being a you know, business owner, father, you know, I, trying to be better to my children than what I had, that's not the type of life that I would like for them to be interested in and show them, you know, as being okay. And police issued nine tickets and are still analyzing security footage and looking through social media posts and videos. Live in Northport, Jolina Spurdo, Wink News.